Yo, what's up? What's going on, guys? Today, I want to show you guys some matches where the legend Equok and myself combined forces to dominate Power League. Make sure you guys like the video. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and let's dive into these matches. Okay, here we go, guys. I'm taking you over to Backyard Bolt for a super sweaty Brawl Ball game. Now, earlier in the day, I was just chilling on the couch, playing Brawl Stars, watching anime. Nothing new about that. And then I stumbled into this lobby with Equok on my team, which is super random and something you just cannot plan out. Uh, and so that's why the games aren't live recorded. However, I think they're fantastic games and I'm really proud to show them to you guys. Uh, also, Equok's on my team in this game and the next game. So we really popped off here to dominate these lobbies. Uh, and I, I don't remember the draft anyway. I want to talk more about the gameplay. Uh, I took Meg first pick. I think they took Daryl Lola. We took Bell Spike, and they took uh, what are they? What else do they have? A uh, Piper? Maybe they took Piper before Lola. I don't remember. Regardless, we got a sweaty bout here, and they played it really well at the start. They uh, put a lot of pressure on Meg when I don't have my suit. Uh, pretty much Meg's trash with no suit, right? And so these guys were utilizing their ability to uh, play aggressive, and they almost scored at the start. However, you can see here, I'm clearly popping off, absolutely dominating the game, and we're already up one nothing. And these are on the European servers, so I have a bit of delay here, and it's not the most clean gameplay I've ever played in my life. I feel like I'm, I'm playing in the land before time and uh, hanging out with the dinosaurs, lagging. It's not great, and as you guys can see here, I think, yeah, okay. Clearly things aren't going our way, and they're gonna be able to score and tie it up one to one. And, uh, yeah, like I said, watch, they come out here on fire, like, they know I don't have my suit, and they come out here firing, or is it next game? Okay, it's gotta be next game. Uh, they come out firing on all cylinders really early on, and I'll point it out when it happens, but anyway, I get my suit, and we take out the Daryl, this is all fine and dandy, I think I mess up a pass here, yeah, I try and flick the super pass to them, and that's where the lag comes into play and the, my dogs are barking and the, the wind was blowing and the <clears throat> anyway not important didn't mess up the pass and uh yeah we're in a great spot here holding a ton of control with 15 seconds left i decide to uh pick the ball up for no reason and swing it over daryl rolls on in i have my suit pop it in the corner and now we move until daryl hops onto me and destroys my suit in two seconds uh they sling the ball to piper who's in a good spot with her super and I don't know if there's anything you can do about this. Oh, wait. I actually played some good defense. Never mind. Wait a minute. Uh, we come out on top. Victorious here. Uh, the Lola plays actually really well into Meg. I didn't know if Lola was good anymore. Turns out Lola's just good into Meg. Um, unfortunately, Equok goes down there. We have... Uh, I can't read this guy's name. It doesn't matter what his name is because we lost the game. And uh, we find ourselves down 1-0 in sets. And I'm um, going to show you guys the next matches right now. Going crazy. They combine to take out the Daryl as well. And we are in a fantastic spot here to uh, to maybe get a goal, perhaps. Maybe? Not really. I pop out. Uh, psh, just sneak out the bush on Beast. I hit him with the pew pew. And now I got my super. And we're already up one nothing. So this is all fine and dandy right now uh lola tends to melt the meg suit so i'm doing my best to not peek too much uh we had to trade out equok for a kill onto the daryl which was kind of good i guess and now i don't mess this up the super fat the english i don't mess up the super pass that time and uh yeah anyway we didn't score so it doesn't really matter that much and i'm trying to utilize my super here and and get aggressive enough to to use it uh i supered in the goal and I'm just popping off right now. My English isn't popping off. But anyway, game three coming up right now. See, I could sit there and cut out all the times that I stutter. But honestly, I think it's kind of funny. And uh, it doesn't really matter that much anyway in the grand scheme of things. Now, I think this... Oh, dude, we're playing so aggressive. How is Equok already up there? How did he already kill the Lola? He should not be up this high. Uh, I'm in a dangerous spot here trying to get my super. I actually get a kill not inside of my mech suit, which is crazy. And... I didn't realize how much we dominated these guys. Like, we shouldn't have lost the first game. Uh, if I didn't blunder the, the pass, we would have scored. Uh, regardless, I come up here, smack the Lola. The Daryl is going to come out here, and uh, I, I kill him too. Sheesh, crazy. Uh, I wait for the Piper jump, and I sneak the ball in. 
able to net ourselves a 1-0 lead in game three right now. Uh, Ekwok still not happy about it, putting up the sad emoji. What's it gonna do, or what's it gonna take to make this man happy? Who knows? Um, anyway, yeah, I get my mech suit. We're chilling. We kill the Piper. We are up so good right now. It's almost unbelievable. And Ekwok is farming these guys, man. He's getting so many kills, doing so much damage. I think they might score here because the Daryl rolls onto me, and there's nothing I can do about this. How how am I supposed to do anything about this? And we went from 100% control to yikes really fast. And now it's one to one game three. Everything's on the line here. All the elo out here. Uh, and I had to pop off. I get the mech suit. I pop the gadget. We're healing up. We're going into battle. And I realize a big key like that right there. I smacked him with the super right before his roll. So I hit him for the four, like three or 4,000 damage. Uh, and that's huge uh, when you're going against a Daryl as a, as a Meg. Uh, not that it's that hard anyway, but what I'm saying is getting that early damage before he rolls is insane. Um, yeah, anyway, I was just pointing that out. It's really important. Obviously, I'm playing a level 11 Meg. Like it's really, my job is pretty easy in this game. I just have to get the suit, hit some shots, do some damage and uh yeah as you can see i'm out here frying look i smacked the daryl that time and he was still able to almost kill me luckily the bell was there to help me out and we get a team wipe 10 seconds left you guys already know what's gonna happen ggs no re we take the first match of the video and i've got another match with me and equok on the same team right now okay again we find ourselves on backyard bowl and again i'm playing meg I, I, you can't script this. I caught the first pick both times, and they were telling me to take Meg, and, you know, I, I got to do it. I got to do it. And this time we're on NA servers, by the way. Particularly, I think the East servers, because my connection was so clean this game. I, you guys can see how many shots I'm hitting and connecting, and, uh, like, I don't know. I, like, maybe you guys won't even notice it, but I already have a suit. We're in a good spot. Charles popping off here, going to be able to put his minions down. I'm going to take out the bell here in just a second, and we're going to score no problem at all and uh, take an early 1-0 lead right now and uh yeah it's crazy how big the servers play a difference in like you know like how big latency plays a factor in and i'm sure equok had some delay this time and wasn't exactly feeling the best but charles and i popping off here uh get a ton of damage in good heals from equok all around just a very clean game so far I don't really know what to do with it. This ball, uh, the Daryl hits a double roll into me. And when you're a Meg and you pop out of your suit, you just spam the auto aim and just try and get shots towards your next super. Uh, Charles with a great Tara pull there. And I do we score this? There's no way. Yeah, there's no shot. If he's marked by the bell, there's no way we were going to score that. Uh, what am I doing? Oh, there I am. Uh, <laughs> just coming out of respawn, dying, no big deal. I think I'm close to my super, which is why I'm playing so far up. And there we go. So another Meg suit. And uh, yeah, if you're playing Meg, you got to be getting your suits. That's the thing, man. Even if you die sometimes, it's important. It's just like playing Sandy. To Like getting your supers is why you're in the game. Uh, anyway, I pop out the suit, kill the Leon, and we take a 2-0 victory. And I'll show you guys next games right now. Okay, next round here. Uh, same strategy. I'm gonna just be sliding down the bushes, hitting them with the uh, hitting them with the pew pew, trying to get my super. Leon running right up to me, uh, and uh, good heals from Ekwok. It's not his fault I died there, but I got really close to my super. And these guys came out here playing unrelentingly aggressive, and we were lucky enough to be able to stop them right there uh, and thwart their offensive efforts and here we are now we're, we're good uh i didn't even know there's a bell mine there i don't think i tripped it oh how did i not step on that not important uh a good pull from charles here gonna be able to take out the daryl i'm just trying to put some pressure on the leon here dodging shots also while not taking any damage i don't want to feed his super too much because uh you know it's game changing when you give it to him he pops it right there i know he pops it i try and send some shots over there uh unfortunately the Leon super moved right into a Tara pull from Charles. And with three of them dead right now, I'm going to be able to score yet another goal for my team. I'm like a young Ronaldo out here, boys. Jesus. Scoring all the goals. Crazy. Also, couldn't do it without my team, by the way. My teammates are absolutely popping off there. Good roll from the Daryl. Going to roll directly on the Equok. Take out the source of all of our healing. 
Uh, unfortunately, with me left on the pitch, there's nothing that I can do to stop this offense. And so we find ourselves in a 1-1 uh, tie right now. Daryl decides to roll out onto me. He, look, he has his super, like that shield. And my swing does almost nothing to him because of it. And so, like I said, when you're going to get to Daryl, it's important to make sure you're hitting your swings when they're just outside the shield. That's what I learned from this game. He rolls onto me yet again. This guy will not leave me alone, which you can't blame him. It's his job to just be annoying and to roll on me over and over again. My mouth is starting to dry up from all this talking. But need, uh, regardless, there's only 30 seconds left in this game, and we might have overtime on deck. I just super the ball away. I think this actually kept us from score or conceding a goal here. Maybe not because Charles had his pull, but either way, I think that play alone might have saved us a goal. Um, and yeah, we find ourselves on the defensive back foot right now. Luckily, I do hit a bunch of shots like I always do. I get my super. We take out Milk Jug on the bell, and we all have our supers ready to go. We got a, a little a little stimulus healing pot from Equok. We have a Charles pull. We get two kills going into the start of overtime, and things are looking good, and you know we're not going to mess this one up. And there we go. Another 2-0 victory or i mean our first 2-0 victory i should say and uh yeah clearly equok and i are a, a, a dynamic duo dominating power league and uh yeah anyway that's gonna be it for the video thanks for watching guys i'll have some live gameplay in my next power league video i promise uh thanks for all the support lately like and subscribe i'll see you guys later peace